What is up guys and welcome back to a brand new video and as you can see once again Senna putting it on pole for Mexico which has a massive slipstream down to turn one. So he has got a task trying to keep down, uh, keep behind sorry Max Verstappen and his championship rival Max Battery Bottas as well as Charles Leclerc. But uh, uh, I apologise for the previous episode, um, I did try and use a different micro and it completely failed. So we're just going to go back to using uh, the iPhone. Phone microphone. So here we go then to one, two, three, four, five red lights are on at Mexico. And it's lights out and away we go. Ayrton Senna does get a good start. Ahead of Max Verstappen, who is already pulling alongside. And Charlotte Claire, who has already passed Ayrton Senna going into turn one. <coughs> Sorry about the cough, but um, Charlotte Claire is in the lead. Senna switches to the inside though, turn one, down the inside. Can't quite make it, now trying to go around the outside for turn two. And gets the inside for turn three, and retakes that lead. Sensational move there by Senna to retake that lead. But now Charlotte Claire already pulling alongside, going on the run down, sorry, into turn five. Senna has the inside line, breaks later, and uh, just gets that position. No, they're still side by side. Has Side by side, sorry. Has to go around the inside of turn six and gets the move done. Ed and Senna managing to keep the lead. Off into lap one. Uh, that bad start may have been a blessing there as it meant it did get the slipstream, sorry, um, going into turn one. And um, now it's uh, Ed and Senna from Lewis Hamilton who has gained two spots. Max Verstappen and uh, Valtteri Bottas who have dropped two. And uh, Fernando Alonso in sixth place. Great start from him. But um, now as we head down into the final sector, um, can Charles Leclerc keep within the DRS range and can Lewis Hamilton as well? Uh, Ferrari have increased their performance of the car, as have Mercedes. And uh, it's just Senna outperforming the car at this point to try and uh, keep his championship hopes alive as he is the current championship leader in the third fastest car. So now with the slipstream Charles Leclerc, you can see it does gain on Ayrton Senna, but only slightly. Maybe he's using a bit of ERS as Senna. Um... And uh, Charles Leclerc now into turn one. Can, is going to try and gain on Senna, who does take a lot of curb there, as you can see. And does gain a tenth, in fact. So that's good from Senna there. Really having to push the track limits to try and make up this time, uh, which has been lost by his car just being uh, an absolute boat to drive. So um, going through the second sector, the S section, this is where... Um, the McLaren isn't great. You can you will be able to see how Charles Leclerc gains through this section. So five tenths at the start of this X section. He actually gains a bit through there. So maybe doing better. Uh, and now through this X section, he is gaining even more. So the dirty air really hurting Ferrari then. Uh, but you can see he only lost a tenth there. So um, doing a nice job there. Stick within the range of uh, Ayrton Senna. Um, through that dirty air, uh, but now the um, the slow section. This is where there's lack of there's the um, sorry a lack of dirty air. So you can see Charles Leclerc is gaining and does have the DRS for the first time this straight maybe. No, he doesn't. That's gonna have to wait till the next lap because it's gonna be a double DRS detection point uh, this straight. But he does have the slipstream anyway, and he does gain uh, back down to four tenths. So keeping the gap consistent, and you can see Max Verstappen is also closing on uh, Lewis Hamilton. Valtteri Bottas has been completely dropped uh, by Max Verstappen. You can think uh, there was battling there with Fernando Alonso, uh, who's trying to help out uh, his Brazilian. A friend there. You can see Charles Leclerc maybe looking for a move there into turn five. Senna does go defensive to try and cover it off and does so. So Senna holding his ground here and um, really doing a nice job here to keep these guys out of his um, overtaking range, really. So now heading through the S section once more, uh, Charles Leclerc will get DRS on this back straight. So... Um, he will be gaining a bit, but you can see in the dirt, yeah, he just loses time there, but then does gain it, actually. Maybe a mistake made by Senna. And uh, now the DRS for Charles Leclerc is active. Now it's closed, but he does gain a tenth down this straight. And that's a relatively short straight. You can only imagine what it's going to be down, uh, be like down this one. Uh, so as they head through it now, Senna, uh, through the last corner, well, the penultimate corner, four-tenths the gap, three-tenths now. It's already... Um, it's already uh, deteriorating. You can see him going very defensive there. Does Senna and Charles Leclerc uh, moves towards the slipstream. And he's going to pull out of it in just a second here to try and overtake Ed and Senna around the outside. 
of turn one. And uh, I think he's ahead before the breaking zone. No, he's not. Senna is going to try and fight back around the outside of turn two. Uh, down the inside for turn three. And they're still side by side through this um, uh, section. And now maybe Lewis Hamilton, sorry, wants a bit of this action. Uh, but they're still side by side blocking the road. Charles Leclerc gets past Senna, tries the move. And now he's got Lewis Hamilton for company. Um, and Charles Leclerc is into the lead of this race. Uh, but is it... Is it wrong timing for Charles Leclerc? Because now at Senna is going to get the DRS on the back straight once more. And uh, maybe just will pull past uh, the Monegas driver um, down this uh, long straight. So we'll see what happens here. Senna now in the dirt, yeah. And he's he actually um, stuck relatively well. You can, you can see now uh, four tenths of the gap between Charles Leclerc and Ayrton Senna. So as they head through the last section now, Senna getting so close to the back of Leclerc, but Leclerc now getting a better exit and then a better run through the penultimate corner, maybe, and the last one is the gap now four tenths between him and Senna. Five tenths now, so Senna has a bit of a bit bigger gap then to Charles Leclerc than Charles Leclerc did to Ed and Senna. So with the DRS, with the slipstream, is it going to be enough for Ed and Senna on the back straight? This is a shocking camera angle, but he's going to pull. Uh, which way is he going to go, outside or inside? He goes to the inside to Senna, down the inside of turn one with the outside for turn two. Uh, tries to get a switch back though. Doesn't really work. And now Charles Leclerc uh, is still ahead on this straight now. And Senna with the DRS. Can he get past? Moving to the outside now. Switches to the inside. Down the inside goes Ed and Senna. And that is a beautiful move there from the Brazilian driver to take the lead once more of this race. Switching early to the inside. Get him, gave him the inside line. He does go wide there. Um, but he should be safe. This straight, this next rate is not long enough for Senna, uh, Charles Leclerc, sorry, to maybe get past Senna. So uh, it's been a great race from Senna here. Beautiful racecraft, brilliant, daring overtakes, and um, he's gonna come home through this last sector now on the last lap of the race to extend his championship lead. Possibly he just has to not screw up through this last section, and unless he spins out through this corner and maybe out of the penultimate corner, there is no way Senna can lose this race. So through the penultimate corner now. Tractioning up for the final time. It's Ed and Senna who comes around the final corner to win in Mexico from Charles Leclerc, who put up a great fight. Hamilton, Verstappen, Sainz, um, Fernando Alonso, and Valtteri Bottas lost even more points there. Um, down in seventh, Fernando Norris, um, Yuki Snowda, Gasly, Vettel, uh, Stroll, Raikkonen, and Ocon Perez, uh, who had a shocking race to be fair, Giovinazzi, and then I think Mazepin was at the back again. But um, Sainz with the fastest lap of the race, but Senna, what a drive there from the Brazilian. Really um, increasing his lead, dominating really, apart from that being overtaken once. You can see extending his lead by quite a fair bit, 21 points to Valtteri Bottas in the driver standings. And uh, Lando Norris stays where he is, Charles Leclerc moves up in the, uh, in the standings, now up into sixth. But Valtteri Bottas has lost a quite a few points uh, there, McLaren only six behind. Mercedes in the constructors, so the, uh, this constructors battle is really hotting up. You can see as well, AlphaTauri and Ferrari fairly close, or is that AlphaTauri and Alpine? I don't know. But uh, thank you for watching. It's been good. Goodbye.